So basically we found um, a new variant in a new gene that, uh, that was associated with, uh, with Alzheimer's disease and this is uh, really important because um, having uh, new genes associated with, with the disease will allow us to um, study and to understand the, the biology of the disease um, better and eventually in the future to, to be able to develop therapies that will be based on, on, this, on these findings. So it's, it's really exciting to have a new piece of the puzzle to, to put together uh, in, in Alzheimer's disease. Uh, so our next step uh, will uh, be to understand uh, the biology of, of this variant and of this gene in the context of, of the disease um, to see how, um, how the cells of, of individuals with this disease uh, and with this variant behave uh, differently from the cells of individuals that don't have the variant and don't have the disease. So people should not be worried about having the, the, the gene, the variant. Uh, this is a very rare variant. Um, and um, in the same way as, as APOE, uh, people with the variant uh, may not develop the disease. Um, so it's not um, a direct cause of disease, it's a risk factor for, for the disease. So um, if I have the variant, it doesn't mean that when I get to 65 years of age I will have Alzheimer's disease. Um, so we, had, we have a very um, large number of groups collaborating um, to get this work together uh, and this was the only way uh, possible to, to put something like this together. Um, and it was great to see that everyone was happy to collaborate and we had uh, wonderful results because everyone, everyone collaborated in such uh, an enthusiastic way. If we didn't have uh, funding, this, this would be completely impossible to, to, to do. So it's, um, and, and it's going to be even more important now um, that we know what we, what we have uh, to be able to, to know what this gene does, um, so we need money to do the first part and that's to find the new pieces of the puzzle, new genes, new variants that will uh, be involved in the disease and we need uh, money to follow up uh, all these genes uh, that we are finding and that hopefully we will find in the, in the near future. I, I think Alzheimer's Research UK has a big hand here and this, this can be considered one big uh, finding from uh, Alzheimer's Research UK um, money well spent, I think. <laughs>